Yes, ma'am. Hello. Good morning, ma'am. How, How are, are you? you? Yes, oh. I'm good. So your name is Saida. Yes, my name is Sayada. So Sayada, tell okay. me about yourself. So, okay. As you know, my name is Sayada. Okay. I am connecting you from city of Telangana. Okay. I I have completed my graduation in commerce stream. Okay. That's okay. all about me. So Sayada, what are you doing right now after doing BCom? Actually, I am a homemaker. Okay. You are married. Yes, I am married. So just after graduation, you got married. No, no. Before graduation only, I got married. Okay. Before I did graduation after. Yeah. Okay. You did graduation after your marriage. Yes. Yes. So after class twelve, you got married. Yes. After twelve, I got married. So at what age did you get married? At uh, you can say seventeen or eighteen. Okay. You got married at the age of seventeen or eighteen. So you don't remember yes. your birthday? Yes. Don't you remember your birthday? Yeah, I do remember. Yeah, so, at the I'm age of when I'm come about to complete eighteen, then okay. At that you time, I was married. married. Okay, then you got married. Yeah. Now, now you are in Telangana. And before marriage, where were you living? No, in the same state only. Okay, okay. So you lived in Telangana yes. only before marriage, also. Yes. Okay. I was born and brought up here only. Okay. After marriage, also I I'm here. Do you have some topic in mind? No, I don't have. You can always suggest some topic so that we can discuss. Okay. Uh, are there any shopping malls in your area? Shopping malls. Yes, there are shopping malls in my area. And restaurants in which uh, people speak in English. Nowadays, waiters also speak in English in restaurants. No. Yeah. Who speaks in English? Only. Okay. Uh, let's say you are ordering something, ordering food online. Or maybe you are ordering food on phone. Then you will have to speak in English, right? Yes, yes, yes. So let's say you want to order some food, and you don't have any time to cook dinner tonight. Okay. And you want to order food, and uh, I am running a restaurant. You have to give me the order. So okay. Yeah. So ring ring. <laughs> Is this... hello? Yeah. Is this Zomato res restaurant? Yeah, it is linked with Zomato, but the restaurant's name is. Uh, give me some name. Let's say it is a uh, Haldira. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are connected to Zomato, but our restaurant's name is Haldira. Okay, so actually, I have an order. I want to give an order. Okay. What are so? What is the main course available in your restaurant? What we can have? Uh, Ma'am, please uh, check the menu online. Mm -hmm. Call us again. to place the order because uh, we don't have any time to tell you the menu over the phone so please go through the menu and after that call us okay okay so okay. online i have to check online and yeah place the order yes please check the menu okay. items after that give us a call okay, okay thank you so now you do one thing you now go through the menu and just decide what all you are going to order after that you pick up the phone okay Okay. Right. So you ask your children also what they want to have. So yes, I have an order. Can you please place an order for me? I want. You can say it. So you can be my order. Please take my order. Okay. I have an order. Please take my order. Yes. I want two plates of chicken biryani. Two plates of chicken biryani. Yes. And and uh, and two plate. Two plates of gulab jamun. Okay. In dessert, two okay. plates of gulab jamun, and three three cocktails. Okay, three cocktails. Three cups of. Okay. Yeah. So is that all? So when you that's all. Yeah. Yeah, How that's all. Okay. How will you pay, ma'am? I will pay online. You will pay online by UPI or card. Yeah, I will pay by UPI. Okay. So yeah. your total amount. Total payable amount is fifteen hundred. Fifteen hundred. Okay, yes. I will pay fifteen hundred. When my parcel will reach the home? When will I receive the order? Say when will I receive the order? When? Okay. When will I receive the order? Uh, within thirty minutes, ma'am. But uh, make the payment first. Okay. Make the payment and send me the screenshot. Okay. Okay. So here I am doing. Okay. Can you please? Yes. I have sent you the QR yeah, code. Payment is done. Yeah. I received the screenshot, and uh, now give me the address. 
Yes. Yes. I have sent the address also. Okay. Okay. So please give me any landmark. Is there any landmark? There is a modern college. Okay. Modern college. Okay. The college name is Modern College. Yes. Okay. So it is. Yeah. yeah. It is in it front is of government your house? college. Okay. Yeah, it is in front of my house. Okay. So our executive will be reaching your house within thirty minutes. Okay. Your order will reach you okay. within thirty minutes. Okay. Yeah. If I not get within thirty minutes, so what shall I do? Then you can get a hundred rupees off on your total amount. He will give you hundred rupees there and then. Okay. He will give me. Yes. Okay. 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 So now the delivery person calls you. Ma'am, I am standing in front of the okay. modern school. I can't see your house. Please tell me where is it? Okay, by that college you come straight and take first left. Okay, here I'm, one boy is standing. I'm, I'm facing the college. So now where should I go? Yes, you are facing the college. So yes. take left. Okay. Take left, then come straight. Okay. Then take one. Take one more left. One person is standing over there. You can he can take the order. He okay. will take the order. Okay, so here you can say take a left turn and then go straight. To take another left turn, uh, someone from my family will be standing. He will take the order. But how will I recognize this person? No, he only recognize you. I think you wear the Zomato oh uniform. So by that he can know you. Okay. So he will recognize you since you are wearing Zamata uniform. So my son will recognize you himself. Yeah. You don't need to do anything. Just hand over the Just order to him. Okay. Yes. Uh, okay. Yes. So now you got the order, <laughs> and now our conversation is complete. <laughs> <Thank you. laughs> okay. Yes. Ma now you received uh, okay. two chicken biryanis and uh, three gulab jamuns. But there are five people in the house. Yeah. How will five people eat three gulab jamuns? Tell me. <laughs> no, in one, in one plate there are two gulab jamuns. Okay, in one bowl. So yeah. that means there are total six gulab jamuns, and people are five. There are five yeah. people and six gulab jamuns. Yeah. Now, who will get that extra yes. gulab jamun? <laughs> I will. I will distribute. I will okay. distribute in three of them. Okay, each one to each one, and then the one that is left, you will divide it into three parts, to, so that your three children. Yes. So now you want to go for a job. Yes, I want to do a job. That's okay. why I want to improve my communication skills. So I am connecting to the people through like this, like okay. this. Yeah. What kind of job you would like to do? Actually, I did B. Ed. Also. Okay, you want yeah. to become a teacher. Yeah, I want to become a teacher. Okay, and I want to teach English subject. Okay, you want to teach English subject. Then I think you should have done BA English honors. That would have been better. Yeah, at that time I was not clear. Okay, you were not clear. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Is your husband okay with that? Yeah, yeah, he is okay with that. Okay, what does he do? He is a business. He has a business. Yeah. He is a businessman. What kind of business? He has um, Italian sofa. You know Italian sofa. Okay, Italian furniture. Yeah. yeah, Italian furniture. Okay, he deals in Italian furniture. Okay, are you living in a joint family? Yes, I do live in joint family. Mm -hmm. There are uh, seven members in my family. Okay. Yeah. You don't have any children right now. No, no, I do have children. Okay. I have three kids. You have three kids. Yes. Okay. How old are One, they? My younger one is ten years old, and middle one is eight years old, and youngest is four year old. So the youngest one is not ten years old. That is the oldest one. So you can say my oldest one is ten years old, middle one is okay, eight years sorry. old, and the youngest one is four years old. Okay, I'm yeah, sorry. And how old are you? I am now. I am twenty eight years old. Okay, so at the age of twenty-eight, you have three children. You had your first child at the age of eighteen. Yes. Okay. So you must be very busy with the kids. Yeah, all the time I was. I like busy. I I don't get time for myself. Yeah. To for I want to have upgrade. 
okay. myself too mm-hmm. so but these days these days i'm getting a little time up to upgrade myself but before that i'm not getting time okay yeah you were not getting any time for yourself earlier but now you have some time since the yeah. uh, summer vacations are going on that is why yeah summer vacation is about to finish from day oh, after yes, tomorrow yes. they ha- they have school from day after tomorrow actually when they will go to school then you will have more time because in morning by 10 o'clock everyone will be gone and after 10 o'clock you will have some time for yourself yes isn't yes. it yeah and during yes. summer vacation they stay home all day and they trouble you all day i think then it is difficult to take out time for yourself isn't it yes exactly yeah okay. exactly true so they fight with each other yeah they all the time they fight with each other and they they trouble me as well they don't keep quiet a single minute okay keep chatting yeah. all day and they don't keep quiet at all yes yes how do they pass their time do they just keep using their mobiles no no actually i am not giving them mobile okay so much i have fixed a time for giving mobile mm-hmm. yeah i gave them only for one hour to watch okay then after after coming from the school they do they do some they have some snacks and after having snacks they just they start playing with each other okay okay yes you don't let them use phone for for long you have fixed timings to use yeah. mobile and you don't give yes, them mobile all day so they only get mobile for one hour to play and when they come back home yes. they have some snacks and after that they start playing with each other yes, yes. when you go to the ptms then do you face difficulty because teachers speak in english yeah so, yeah i face some difficulties when i go to the ptm okay but somehow i manage but some times i am not able to who pr- give i am not able to convey all the things okay i am i am not able to ask all the things which i have in my mind okay okay i am unable to construct a sentence which are running in my mind okay. so at that time i switch my language and mm-hmm. i ask okay and which is your mother tongue my mother tongue is urdu that you start speaking in urdu yes okay so when you yes. go to the ptms you manage somehow but sometimes you are not able to express what you think and you can't yes. ask them all the questions that are there in your mind and you are not able to yes. express yourself isn't yes, it yes exactly yes. yes so what are you doing to improve your english now I, nowadays i am watching conversation videos okay and all english content through youtube as much as i can okay able to listen i am doing that okay so you try to watch english conversation and watch as much english content as possible yes right yes. and what about your husband does he speak english well no he is also speak he is intermediate level okay he is also an he at an speak. intermediate level so mm-hmm. tell me how, how are your children doing in english is there english atmosphere in their school yes they are yes there is a atmosphere in their school Okay. But uh, they are not uh, very fluent. Okay. Because yeah. In they are not very fluent. Yeah. My daughter. Mm-hmm. If I talk about my daughter, she yeah. can speak. Okay. She can speak English well. Yeah. She can speak English well. She's ten years old. Compared to my old. son. Okay. Yes. Mm-hmm. Compared to my sons, he can speak. Okay. Yes. So he's ten years old, and your sons are eight and four, right? Is it compulsory to speak English in their school? yeah they said that it is compulsory but uh, i'm not uh, 100% sure okay. whether they are talking in english or not so you're not yeah. 100% sure if they speak in english yeah. all the time if it is compulsory yeah. then it is very good for your children because then they will have this habit of speaking in english all the time and their communication will improve yeah. and you should put yes, your yes. children in a school where english is compulsory because in other schools even the teachers principal everyone they all speak in hindi then it's very yeah. difficult to improve english yeah, yeah that's true in such schools where english is not yeah. compulsory those children suffer a lot and then then they have to work very hard to learn english but yeah. the other children yeah who are in such schools yes, where english is compulsory like they learn very easily yeah. 
Yeah. Otherwise, they have to struggle like me. Yes, yes. They have to struggle because children who come from Hindi medium schools, they have to struggle a lot while learning English. But nowadays, uh, nowadays or before or uh, two decades ago, yeah. Uh, if the medium of uh, schools are English, they the children are not able to speak in English. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Loss of yeah. environment. Yeah. Correct. Even in the English medium schools, all the teachers used to speak in Hindi. Yes. 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 But now there are many schools where English is spoken all the time. Yes. yes. Now everyone is uh, aware of and everyone knows the importance of this language. Correct. They all know. Because later yeah. on, when they go to yeah. office, when they go for interviews, everywhere they will only speak English. So it's better that they start doing that in school itself. Yes. Yes, yes, exactly. Yeah. One more thing I want to share you that uh, now the schools are appointing the teachers who are uh, not that much uh, educated or knowledgeable. Correct. Which they can handle the children. Right. That's why also, that's why also the children are facing so much uh, difficulty problems, so much difficulties so they are facing. The, the just teachers are doing their job just to complete the things, the syllabus and all. They yeah. don't want to, to understand understand them well. They don't understand the concept. Yeah. Yeah. Just they are in hurry to finish the syllabus. They want to finish their work. Correct. We want yeah. to put so, our children in private schools and mostly private schools. They want to hire teachers in less salary. They should love teaching if they are in this profession. Yes. Yeah, in uh, most of the school teachers are like that, that every student has to take tuitions because they don't understand the concepts in school. Yes, yes. Teachers not, yes, yes. they are not worried how children are doing in class. Yes, yes. And uh, I don't want to be a that kind of teacher. Yeah. If no. you are going to teach English, then you should... Definitely teach English in a way that your children understand it and learn something yes. from you. They just don't attend the lecture. Yes, exactly. And uh, knowing knowing English is not only the uh, holistic thing. We should have the knowledge of that particular Correct. subject. Mm -hmm. If we don't know the English very well, we yes. can manage. If we have knowledge. Yes. Of that particular subject, you know. Yes. The concept should be clear. Even if the teacher teaches yeah. in Hindi or Urdu sometimes, if his English is not very good, but at least they should know what they are teaching. Yes. And yeah. they should know how to handle the kids. Right. And they should know the uh, mind mindset of the kids. They should connect. Yes. The, they should connect them with them. The they should connect yeah. with the children. They should love the children before they start teaching them. Yes. yes. So that uh, it is easy for the children to express themselves in front of teachers. Yes. And if children are scared all the time, how will they understand anything? They, yes. And most yes. of the teachers do that only. They want children to be scared of them. They would just ask homework, yeah. ki nahi, the, where is the notebook, where is the other notes and everything. They don't want to know what's going on in their minds. Yes. And how they're feeling. So now the education policies are also changing. Yes. They are they are now the education system is also changing. Why means uh, the government has uh, implementing the what can I say? The teachers should focus to should focus to the students more on their skills. Yes, not what they yes. have crammed. They shouldn't cram yeah. what is written. They should just understand the concept practically. Yes, before yeah. leaving school and one more thing, before leaving school, the yeah. student should be capable of uh, doing something. He or she should have a skill on his hand. Correct. Yeah, they should be yeah. skilled before they leave the school. That is true. So can you please... Uh, I know how to improve English and all, but I'm not. Uh, I'm not utilizing my time. My time, I'm not giving 
the time for myself uh, why means i am not uh, getting much time okay. when i do when i i have done with my household work i was like exhausted okay so at that time i don't feel like to practice okay so there is so yeah. much work pressure on you and when you are done with the household chores by that time you are so exhausted that you don't have any energy left to study english yeah. to learn english yeah. yeah i become lethargic yeah mm -hmm. but you will have to take out time somehow and make your children independent so that you have more time for yourself because otherwise there is no other way and uh, maybe your yeah. husband if he gets some time yeah, he can also sure. take care of the children yeah yeah yes yes you will have to spend a lot of time for learning english because uh, if you don't spend enough time then it will take so many years so spend as much time as you can and uh, yeah. watch conversations watch english content and you know what to do the basic things you know reading yes. writing watching conversations listening to english content that is all we require and nothing new yeah but you have to take out time somehow yes yeah i'm i'm listening so much okay i'm consuming a lot okay you're consuming but a lot of english I'm, content but you are not practicing yes. enough you are not practicing english speaking uh, yes i'm not practicing you will have to find someone who can speak english with you regularly or you will have to join some app where you get tutors okay. who will speak with you yes Because if you just keep listening only listening and only watching content will not help uh speaking is the most important yes. part yeah i will adapt this habits as well in my daily routine so that i am able to speak fluently saida uh, this meeting is going to so be over in two minutes so let's say bye to each other what were you saying can you please give me feedback you're speaking well very few grammar mistakes you are making so you can improve further by listening to more english and uh, write for a while maybe for just 5 minutes a day and read every day plus the most important thing speak to someone every day if possible in english you are speaking well you are not at the basic level okay okay yeah, so i am not improving you know i am not improving improvement will come only when you start speaking with other people yeah consuming english content is one thing but you have to speak also okay yeah yes maybe if you don't get anyone then you can start speaking in front of the mirror also or you can call customer care and on ace fluency you can get audio calls free of cost yeah, but i don't find it uh, useful okay yeah yeah you yeah. will be connected to the students only co learners only yeah, so but you can take the paid course the if you take the paid course yeah. you will be connected to the tutors that will be really helpful mm -hmm. Yeah, I should take the paid course. Yes, yes. You should definitely take the paid course. If these sometimes if these apps works, but not the all time. All the time I am connecting to the beginners or some some people are using those apps to just pass thing the time. Yeah, there are some you know such people also who just randomly yeah. use these apps and they don't want to do anything. They just yeah wait i mean <laughs> so is that it very quickly yeah so it's As better to get connected to tutors instead of just talking to the co learners yes. yes 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 exactly yeah okay saida it was a lovely conversation i hope you will join some good app i think ace fluency yes. is a wonderful <laughs> app you should join that and uh, you can get 10% discount on their paid subscriptions if you take my code which will be in the description of this video Okay. okay you can okay. utilize that for availing 10% discount on the paid courses okay ma'am okay so okay, saida what's in the description box what's in the description box mein aapko link mil jayega if you okay, click okay. on that link then you will get 10% off you will have to use okay. my code for availing that discount okay saida okay ma'am bye bye okay. all the best connecting me yeah welcome to you. saida thanks for giving me this opportunity Your valuable time for giving me. Yeah, I also loved. Thank you, Saida. Bye bye. Bye. You look so pretty, ma'am. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much.